Welcome back. This is Swift Passage. Thanks for all you new subscribers out there. Thank you. This is God's holy channel. This is God's holy channel. Um, I wanted to give you a message I received from the Lord today that I immediately got a confirmation for. Um, boy, there's lots going on around the globe. It's increasing in frequency. The signs of King of Kings and Lord of Lords is coming. Uh, I just saw there's a super typhoon that's going to hit Taiwan. A super typhoon. This is the biggest storm right now in the world. A super typhoon is going to hit Taiwan. Plus, you know, I'm originally from Minnesota and, and they had flash flooding. Normally they don't. They don't. I was watching as the cars were trying to drive through the flooded streets. To me, it kind of looked like a river flowing through through the streets. I could not believe what I was seeing. Um, a fire is raging out of control in um, New Mexico. It looks like maybe a wildlife refuge. Wow. I mean, it just continues, 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 daily, daily, daily now. People, if you don't know the signs, the signs are pointing to the soon return of Jesus Christ. You can go over to Luke, uh, uh, Luke, Matthew, um, Luke 21, 25, Matthew, um, can't think of the, the, the scripture offhand, but this says right in there, the signs are pointing to the return of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. You know, um, the time is very short now. I feel it strongly in my spirit. I feel from the severe attacks I'm, I'm, I've had, especially in the last two days, they've been very, um, very, uh, very, very bad. I was going to use another word for that, but they were very, very bad. I was really, really um, having a hard time. And, you know, um, these are attacks are, are a sign that, of the soon return of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. I received this message today. This is a message I received. To, I received this today, today, July 6th at 4 p.m. Tell my people, this is it, my son. The trials and testings are going to end. Immediately, my son, you and many will be in my presence. Tell my people, what is about to take place is the harpezo, the rapture, the great catching away. My son, the moment is going to happen quickly in a flash. The kingdom awaits all my children who await my appearing. Shalom, my bride. And you know, this is what I got. I, I heard my son go to Daniel chapter 9 verse 14 and read it. Daniel chapter 9, verse 14. King James Bible. Daniel chapter 9, verse 14. Therefore has the Lord watched upon the evil and brought it upon us. For the Lord our God is righteous in all his works, which he doeth. For we obeyed not his voice. And I got in my spirit, this is, um, this is um, judgment. Judgment is at hand. What's going on around the world is God is not pleased with people. They will not obey him in his word, in whatever he's asking of them. And they've turned to 
evil and wickedness. This is what the Lord was showing me. The Holy Spirit was showing me. So, we are on the countdown. How many days, weeks, or months? I, I have no idea. But what I do know is the Lord is very near. We don't have years left. This is the year of His coming. This is the year. Don't doubt, just believe. The Lord lifted me up to, 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 to give you guys this information because many were afraid to give out this information in fear of man. I don't fear man. I fear the Lord. And I know soon my, I'm going to stand before the judgment seat of Christ and make it count for what I did or didn't do. I know that day is fast approaching, and yes, I'm afraid of that day, but I'm also happy because I'm going to be in the kingdom of God. I'm going to be in the kingdom of God, like many of you are. You know, um, we are the kings. We are sealed by God until Redemption Day. We are God's. We are God. If you are saved by grace through faith in Jesus Christ, you are sealed by God. No one can pluck you out of the, out of, out of the Father's hands. I'm going to do a prayer request video tomorrow. A prayer request video for um, there are people in need. If um, listen. I'm praying now for the Lord to come, to not delay his coming. Many have been given warnings for a long time now. God has been given warnings for quite a while now. I know that we are in the very end before the tribulation begins. So, I'm no longer um, uh, going to, um, uh, well, I'm going to put it this way. I'm going to pray always for the Lord to come now. Because like for many of you, the, the attacks are severe. I chose this to be obedient to the Lord. So I knew these attacks would come. I'm not complaining or whining about this because I knew they would come. But my point is I'm, is I'm exhausted, fatigued, just like the rest of you, and I'm ready to go to the kingdom of God. So from now on, I'm going to pray for the Lord to come. I'm going to pray for the Lord to come now. So stay encouraged. We will continue to pray for our loved ones. Many will come to the Lord when the tribulation begins because we have warned them over and over and over again. We have warned them. Stay encouraged, guys. The King of Kings and Lord of Lords, Jesus Christ of Nazareth, is coming quickly. And by the way, I got that encouraging song for you guys. Stay up and blessed. And by the way, pray for me. We have a tornado watch in the corner of South Dakota where I'm at. The only, only spot until 10 p.m. tonight. The weather is wicked. The weather is wicked. But I know the Lord will protect me. I live in a uh, manufactured home. And I know many will pray also. So... Um, say encourage if you've got a praise report or a prayer report I mean a, a prayer send it to D Vargas V A R G U S 25 at gmail.com and um, I will get it up on uh, tomorrow's prayer video so um, I guess it's for now it's Shalom Shalom
If I don't see you um, tomorrow, I will see you in the air. Because we don't know the day or the hour the Lord's coming. But stay up and blessed. Shalom. Of a mighty rushing wind Oh, and it's closer now Than it's ever been I can almost hear the Father As Gabriel sounds the call And at the midnight cry, we'll be going home. When Jesus steps out on a cloud to call his children. Go